As soon as the word vampire is whispered, our minds conjure up haunting images of the legendary characters from European literature and cinema, such as the infamous Dracula in the eerie Nosferatu. However, the truth is far more terrifying than what we have been led to believe. The vampiric legend transcends beyond time and space, gripping different cultures across the world, including the mysterious and alluring land of South America. In this bone-chilling video, we will embark on a journey to unearth the hidden truths about some of the most blood-curdling creatures of the night that originated in Brazil and other South American countries. Beware, for these nocturnal beings differ from their European counterparts in countless ways from their chilling origins to their ghastly appearances, their bone-chilling powers, and their unspeakable weaknesses. With each passing moment, you will delve deeper into the shadowy universe of South American vampires, where mystery and terror intermingle with curiosity and excitement. Brace yourself for a journey of a lifetime, for once you enter this world of South American vampires, you may never return the same. Mandeha, Vampire Gods Deep within the pages of India's oldest epic poem, the Ramayana, lurk the ominous Mandihas, the vampires that haunt the nightmares of the bravest souls. The tale follows the god Rama's journey to rescue his beloved wife Sita from the clutches of the demon Ravana. But amidst the epic saga lies a chapter that speaks of a far-off land, a place known as South America, where the Mandihas dwell. These demonic creatures, like a nightmare come to life, stand upside down like bats during the day, their sickly green skin glistening in the sun, but when the darkness descends, they unleash their terror upon the land, sucking the life out of humans and beasts alike. Their appearance is but a mere fraction of their horror. These monsters are savage and merciless, taking on different forms and sizes. Every day they engage in a battle against the sun, but it always triumphs, forcing them to retreat into the shadows. However, should they ever succeed in their quest, the world will be shrouded in an eternal darkness, and their tyranny will reign supreme. Some believe that these terrifying creatures are an allusion to the pre-Columbian peoples of South America, known for their brutal rituals of human and animal sacrifice. Others suggest that they are the embodiment of the Mayan god Kamazots, a monstrous vampiric bat associated with death, sacrifice, and the night. One thing is for certain, the Mandihas will continue to haunt our dreams, a chilling reminder of the horrors that lurk in the shadows of the unknown. Kara, Shapeshifting Vampires Deep in the Amazon rainforest, amidst the dense foliage and mist, lurks a creature of pure horror, the Kaura. Revered as one of the most feared vampires in Brazil, the Mura indigenous people have whispered tales of its terror for centuries. This monstrous beast has the ability to transform itself into a giant bat with a wolf's head and colossal wings, capable of carrying an adult ox and ripping the roof off a house with ease. It dwells in the depths of caves, venturing out only at night to satiate its insatiable thirst for blood and flesh. The Kaura has a potent power to enchant its victims, weaving a spell that leaves them in a deep slumber, unable to defend themselves as it descends upon them with razor-sharp fangs. It's said to select its prey through dreams, stalking them in the ethereal realm before materializing in the physical world to make its kill. It can also shapeshift into a menagerie of other creatures, including humans, and relishes in hunting and killing other supernatural beings, absorbing their powers with each attack. Surviving an encounter with the Kaura requires unwavering courage and utmost care. If provoked, it can unleash a deadly toxin that quickly poisons its victim. There is no known method to kill the Kaura, but legends tell that it fears the flicker of fire and the beat of drums. Some even claim that it can be summoned through a complex ritual involving the burning of fur and feathers, mixed raw meat offerings in the woods, and fish bones in the rivers, accompanied by sacred chants and guttural cries. However, the summons must be approached with extreme caution, as even the slightest mistake could mark one as the Kaura's next victim. Jararaka, Vampire Snake Beware the Jararaka, the shape-shifting vampire that slithers through the Brazilian countryside. By day, it takes on the form of a woman, blending in with the locals, but when the sun sets, it transforms into a venomous snake, ready to strike. Its favorite prey, nursing mothers and their helpless infants, the Jararaka strikes at night, slipping into homes unnoticed and sinking its fangs into the sleeping mother's breast. With each suck, it takes in not only milk but also blood, leaving its victim weak and delirious. The toxin it secretes numbs the bite site, preventing any outcry for help. And beware, for once the Jararaka has found a favored victim, it will return night after night, draining the life force until there is nothing left. It can take on any shape it desires, be it a bird or a beast, 
but its most insidious form is that of a human, blending in with the unsuspecting populace. The Jararaka lurks in the shadows of the countryside, hiding away in caves and crevices, striking only when the time is right. Beware the milk snake, for it may be closer than you think. Azeman, Sorceress Vampires Beware the Azemans, for they are not your typical European vampires, cursed by the devil or bitten by another vampire. These are creatures born with dark powers, with the ability to shapeshift into bats, wolves, or other animals, and roam the night for their prey. Their origins lie in the dense jungles of Suriname, but they have spread throughout South America, waiting for the right moment to pounce on their victims. Azemans are not easily deterred by crosses or holy water, for they are not bound by any religious symbols. Instead, they have a strange obsession with counting and telling things, a weakness that can be used against them. But be warned, if you ever encounter an Azeman, it's best not to provoke them, for they are powerful and merciless. During the day, Azemans appear as ordinary women, living among us, but as the sun sets, they transform into their true form and hunt for their prey. They are swift and cunning, and can move undetected, striking their victims without warning. Once they taste blood, they become addicted, often returning to the same victim for more. To protect yourself from an Azeman, you can try placing a broom behind your door or scattering seeds on the floor. This will keep the creature occupied until dawn, when it will transform back into its human form and reveal its identity. But be careful, for if an Azeman suspects you of trickery, it may use its dark powers to silence you forever. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel to watch more spooky videos.